Hey guys, welcome to vdgacademy.com. Today's topic is formulas on trigonometric ratios of compound angles. So, first let me revise what is a compound angle. So, compound angle is nothing but the algebraic sum or difference of two or more angles. For example, if a comma b comma c are three angles, then a plus b, a minus b, comma a plus b plus c etc are said to be compound angles. And here in this section, we are going to deal with the formulas of trigonometric ratios of compound angles. So first, let us begin with the trigonometric ratio sine of the compound angle a plus b. That is nothing but sine a plus b is equal to sine a cos b plus cos a sine b. And then the next formula which is sine a minus b. So sine a minus b is equal to sine a cos b minus cos a sine b. And now let us proceed and discuss the another trigonometric ratio which is cos. So cos a plus b is equal to cos a cos b minus sine a sine b. And then the next formula which is cos a minus b. So cos a minus b is equal to cos a cos b plus sine a sine b. And then the next trigonometric ratio which is tan. So tan a plus b is equal to tan a plus tan b divided by 1 minus tan a tan b. And the next formula under tan is tan a minus b. So tan a minus b is equal to tan a minus tan b divided by 1 plus tan a tan b. And then the next trigonometric ratio which is cot. So cot a plus b is equal to cot b cot a minus 1 divided by cot b plus cot a. And the next formula under trigonometric ratio is cot a minus b. So cot a minus b is equal to cot b cot a plus 1 divided by cot b minus cot a. So here these are the formulas for compound angle a plus b under different trigonometric ratios. And now let us write the formulas for compound angles a plus b into a minus b under the trigonometric ratio sine. That is sine a plus b into sine a minus b which is equal to sine square a minus sine square b and this is also equal to cos square b minus cos square a. And now let us discuss the same formula under the trigonometric ratio cos. That is cos a plus b into cos a minus b is equal to cos square a minus sine square b which is also equal to cos square b minus sine square a. And now let us proceed and discuss the formulas for the compound angle a plus b plus c. So first let us begin with sine a plus b plus c. So sine a plus b plus c is given by the formula sine a cos b cos c plus cos a into sine b into cos c plus cos a cos b into sine c minus sine a sine b into sine c. And now let us discuss the compound angle a plus b plus c under the trigonometric ratio cos. That is cos a plus b plus c is equal to cos a cos b cos c minus cos a sine b sine c minus sine a cos b sine c minus of sine a sine b cos c. And now let us discuss the formula for tan a plus b plus c which is equal to sigma tan a minus pi tan a divided by 1 minus sigma tan a tan b. Here we can also write this formula as s1 minus s3 divided by 1 minus s2 where s1 represents sum of the tangents taken one at a time whereas s2 represents sum of the products of the tangents taken two at a time and s3 represents the sum of the products of tangents taken 3 at a time. And similarly, we get the formula for cot A plus B plus C which is equal to sigma cot A minus pi cot A divided by 1 minus sigma cot A cot B which will be equal to S1 minus S3 divided by 1 minus S2 where here S1 represents sum of the cotangents taken 1 at a time 
where S2 represents sum of the products of cotangents at taken two at a time, whereas S3 represents the sum of the products of cotangents taken three at a time. And then we also have a formula like tan pi by 4 plus theta, that is tan 45 degrees plus theta will be equal to 1 plus tan theta divided by 1 minus tan theta. Make a note of all these formulas because we are going to use these formulas in further videos for solving examples on trigonometry. So, these are the formulas of trigonometric ratios under compound angles. Hope you understood the concept. Do like and subscribe to vdchacademy.com. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.